briefcase, briefs, and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In a peculiar twist of international law, a British citizen living in Mexico found relief in the United States Court of Appeals for the Fifth Circuit in 1979, after he was found guilty of receiving a stolen car from El Paso, Texas. The case, known as United States v. Columba Colella, began when Francesco Columba Colella was arrested in 1978 in Juarez, Mexico. Despite his guilty plea, Columba Colella asserted that the court had no jurisdiction over him because he was not a U.S. citizen and his actions occurred solely in Mexico. To articulate its decision, the appeals court used the protective and objective territorial theories, legal tenets guiding jurisdiction over crimes committed abroad by foreign citizens. Through this examination, the court ultimately ruled that it lacked jurisdiction. Since Columba Colella's actions neither threatened U.S. security nor interfered with governmental functions and occurred entirely outside the country, the protective and objective territorial theories could not extend jurisdiction. This led to the reversal of the district court's decision. The court's ruling served a wider aim as well. By dismissing the charge, it promoted mutual comedy, respect for the legal sovereignty of other nations. While this decision could theoretically encourage more car thefts in border towns, the court underlined that each country has the power to punish crimes committed within its own jurisdiction. Consequently, once released, Columba Colella would face sanctions under Mexican law, a stark reminder of the complexity of international justice. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit LSE.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.